You ever been curious about the American president's limousine, dubbed the Beast? This car is described as one of the safest vehicles on Earth, with special bulletproof glass. In contrast, Elon also brings the monstrosity that is the Cybertruck to real life with the revolutionary glass utilized on Starship. So what are the differences between these two types of glass? And in the end, which vehicle will come out on top in terms of safety? Let's find out in today's episode of Tesla car world. Welcome back to the channel. Before we begin, please show your support by subscribing if you haven't already and ringing the bell so you won't miss out on any of our interesting videos in the future. Now, let's get started with today's content. First, let's talk about the bullet resistance of both the Cadillac 1 and the Cybertruck. What are the differences between these two types of glass? Although the exact specifications of the vehicle are classified as a matter of national security and are thus kept secret, we have attempted to compile what information is public here. The Cadillac 1's windows are strictly bulletproof, made of five layers of glass and polycarbonate to put a damper on any effort by subversives. A cosmetic layer of aluminum, black paint, and presidential decals is followed by layers of ballistic steel and titanium. The steel, which is strengthened through heat treatments, and titanium can flatten projectiles to provide a bigger surface area for other layers to catch. Armor Max, polyethylene, and polycarbonate layers are strong, lightweight materials designed to slow and catch projectiles or shrapnel. On the Cadillac 1, all windows are permanently closed except for the driver's window, which opens only a few inches. Even if a bullet was directly fired into the car's glass, it still wouldn't reach the inside. The car is fully protected against any type of attack. Now, now what about Cybertruck's glass? What kind of material is that made out of? Alon is aluminum, oxygen, and nitrogen, and when you put them together in the right proportions, you get this transparent ceramic. Elon Musk cooperated with Sermit to use Alon glasses for Cybertruck. Alon, also known as transparent aluminum armor, is a ceramic alloy made of aluminum oxynitride, a combination of aluminum, oxygen, and nitrogen. Alon is made of three layers, an outer layer that's exposed to gunfire and made of baked aluminum oxynitride, a middle layer of glass, and a rear layer of polymer backing. This material is the hardest polycrystalline transparent ceramic available today and is used in military vehicles as bulletproof glass. Alon is both half the weight and two times stronger than traditional bulletproof glass, and it's resistant to scratches, radiation, various acids, and bases. Alon can withstand extremely high temperatures and large impacts. It's a fantastic option for Cybertruck to explore space. But one aspect certainly attracts a lot of interest. How does the glass of the these two beasts work to resist bullets. For the Cadillac 1, the honeycomb structure of the aluminum absorbs and disperses energy, while the ceramic shatters to achieve the same effect. Additional layers of steel, titanium, polyethylene, and polycarbonate may be present to bolster the capabilities of the armor. A flexible ballistic blanket, which is a lightweight high-strength woven fabric made from synthetic fibers, is fitted to the interior floor to absorb shrapnel from an explosion underneath the the vehicle. Transparent armor glass is made of laminated glass, including tempered glass bound together with plastic resin inner layers. The glass absorbs the projectile's energy, causing the projectile and the glass to shatter. Now, what about the Cybertruck? The result of these tests was that NASA showed that Elon can withstand those impacts without chipping. When struck by a bullet, the layers of glass and oxynitride of aluminum in Alon absorb the energy of the bullet, which will create a cracked spider web, illustrating the outwardly expanding energy as it is absorbed through the pain. Because of its incredible strength, aluminum oxynitride is being considered as a replacement material for the windows on the International Space Station. Some researchers believe that it will be strong enough to stand up to space debris traveling at thousands of miles an hour. With all the preeminent features, how how is the bulletproof effect of the President's car compared to the Cybertruck shown? The 5-inch thick windows in the Cadillac 1 can withstand a grenade, handgun shots of up to 44 calibers, as well as a military rifle attack. For comparison, not only can the aluminum armor in Cybertruck deflect rounds from small caliber weapons while remaining more clearly transparent than shot bullet-resistant glass, 
but it could also pass a much more important test, resisting corrosion from 50 caliber armor-piercing rounds and anti-aircraft weapons that typically use 30 caliber rounds. This is a 50 caliber armor-piercing bullet. This is truly an impressive feat. It seems that the Cadillac 1's bulletproof glass is still inferior to Elon Musk's Cybertruck brainchild. The vehicle was born to beat all the heaviest of munitions. However, as a presidential protection vehicle, Cadillac is outfitted with numerous safety features that the Cybertruck lacks. Even the tires, which have Kevlar reinforcement and run-flat technology, are intended to withstand an attack. Additionally, the car has smokescreen and tear gas dispensers in the boot to deter assaults. Also, the door handles are equipped to, deli to deliver a 120 volt electric shock at the flip of a switch, and to keep passengers safe, the passenger compartment is chemically sealed and has its own oxygen supply. Emergency blood supplies for the president are also stored on board. The Cadillac 1 is a vehicle like none other. The presidential supercar is a true four-wheeled bunker. Whenever the president moves around, he uses his armored limousine. So how much does it cost compared to the Cybertruck? The Beast is estimated to cost at about $1.57 million. For comparison, the most expensive tri-motor Cybertruck was supposedly to command $69,900, making the Beast 23 times more costly. However, the Beast is not the most expensive state limousine currently in operation. The Bentley State Limousine, which was built for Queen Elizabeth II, God rest her soul, cost over $13 million at current exchange rates. Who else has had a hand in developing the Beast? The Beast lives up to its name with a vast swath of equipment to keep the Commander-in-Chief safe and secure. Produced by Cadillac's parent company, General Motors, the Cadillac Presidential Limo is based on GM's medium-duty work truck frame and comes with an exterior style inspired by the Cadillac CT6. The Tesla Cybertruck, on the other hand, is an upcoming battery electric light-duty truck announced by Tesla Incorporated in 2019. According to Musk, the design of the Cybertruck was inspired by Blade Runner and the Lotus Esprit, which was driven by James Bond in The Spy Who Loved Me, which doubled as a submarine. Unfortunately, the submarine feature won't be packaged with the Cybertruck. That's it for today's episode. We sincerely thank you for watching and for all of your support of our channel. As always, if you enjoyed our video, please leave us a like, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell to stay up to date on exciting developments in the world of EVs and green technology. Once again, we thank you so much and we hope to see you again next time. Until then, take care and be safe.